Hi everybody! Welcome back. Today I'm going to be talking about a really great series that's a little different. Um, it is a paranormal romance series and it's a modern romance series. So join me while we talk about it. Okay, today I have with me Karen Robard series. This series that she did is a paranormal romance series and this series ran from 2012 to 2015 and it is based on the character Dr. Charlotte Stone and she's a criminal pathologist. Um, it's a really great series. The series, if you love paranormal series, um, paranormal books, you will definitely love this series, especially if you love the ghost paranormal. And again, it takes place in modern time, you know, so it's, it's a really interesting series and I really loved it. Um, again, it follows Dr. Charlotte Stone. She is a criminal pathologist, but she also you know, has the gift to see dead people or to see things and know things. So it was just a great series. It follows her as she, and again, I don't want to give too much away, but Charlie, as she's called in the book, um, goes to work at a prison where she meets Michael, Michael Garland. Um, he is in there for murder. But basically, to make a long story short, and again, I don't want to give away too much, he dies, but he comes back in ghostly form, so to speak. Um, and he follows Charlotte Stone around, basically. It's, it's just a different kind of love story. I don't even know how to explain it, really. And I think that's where I'm having a hard time here. Um, but it... It's such a good love story, even though it's an odd love story. Again, he's a ghost, you know, she's not, but it works. It really, really works. You know, she takes on um, several cases throughout. There are four books and she takes on several cases, you know, throughout the books with the FBI helping on cases and things. And, you know, Michael's always there and you, you just, Again, I don't I don't know how quite to explain these you know these this book, but it starts out with the last victim, um, where this all starts, and then you get into you know the three other books, and I'm so glad there were at least you know four books in this series. I didn't want it to end, and um, I was sad to see it end, but the books honestly you know kind of kept getting better. I thought you know, but I enjoyed it. I just enjoyed it. I love, again, I don't talk a lot about, you know, the modern romance, but I, I do love those books as well as my historical romances and, you know, all my paranormal sci-fi romances. And this kind of fit the bill, you know, for, you know, the paranormal and the modern. Um, just a great book and the dynamic you know between Charlie and Michael and then Tony who is another love interest in the book it's just great it really is and it is one of my favorite series and I'll tell you when I had to read the last book gosh you just don't want it to end you just don't want you don't want it to go away but Unfortunately, you know, it has to because, you know, again, not giving away any spoilers um, of how everything works out with him coming back and being there and this and that, you know, but gosh, it was, they, they were great. And so if you, again, if you love paranormal, especially the ghost type books, you will really, really enjoy this. Um, because it, again, it's not, 
it's not mythical. It's not, you know, it's not time travel. It is, he comes back as a ghost, you know, and it works. And you're probably saying, well, how does it work? I mean, how does she have this, this relationship with a ghost? Um, but that's the beauty of how Karen Robards wrote these books. It really worked and you don't, it just kind of comes together. You know, I'm have again, I'm sorry I'm rambling, but it's, to me, these are some of the hardest books to explain, you know, because of the way the situation is in the books. But I promise you, you will love them. You absolutely will. Because again, I have them, I keep them on my shelves. Um, and you know when I love a book, I'll tell you how you know when I love a book. I started with a paperback because, you know, I hate to spend all the money on a hardcover unless I, you know, I'm really looking for the book. So I started with a paperback and the rest of them are hardback, which means I ran out and bought them as soon as they came out in hardcover. I did not wait for the paperback, which I do with some of my books. So if, if anyone knows me, that's how you know that I loved these books. So I'm not going to ramble because I know I'm, I'm rambling here, but um, I'm just, I'm just going to highly recommend these books and I promise you, you'll love them. And I'm, again, apologize for rambling here. These are the, some of the hardest books I've had to explain, but still great books. You'll enjoy them. You'll really have a good time reading them. It's a great adventure and very, and if you like crime, let me add this in there because again, I'm sorry, I can't script. A lot of people, you know, they, they script their videos. I can't do it. It's just too much for me. <laughs> I can't, I can't do it. So I'm probably leaving out the fact if you like criminal, um, like true crime and that sort of thing, you will also, you know, find that very interesting in this book because they do follow serial killers, you know, and murders like that with these FBI cases. So I should add that in there, you know, um, a little late than ever, but I should add that in that, there are some great stories with all of her her modern romance books if you read those they're usually based on FBI and this and that and it they're really good they're really good I just love her writing but this has to be one of the favorite series that she does that I absolutely loved and I hated to see it to see an end but it did so with that I'm going to stop rambling and just recommend this Please, if you haven't read them, read them. You'll love them. And with that, you guys have a good day and happy reading.